concert promoting is a dog-eat-dog -dog business. I mean, I only want marquee bands playing my venue, marquee. I mean, last Friday night we had this killer lineup. It was the Butt Munchers opening for Jacob's Fatter. I mean, it was the ska grunge event of 2013. My name is Ryan Skullface. I'm a concert promoter here at the White Hills Teen Center in White Hills, Connecticut. The club is located on uh, like a zone, like I don't know how you describe it. Basically there's a junior high that some of the kids go to and there's a junior high that some of the other kids go to and you get, you know, it's like gangland out there, you know, especially during soccer season. Uh, my age, I just, I turned 18 15 years ago, roughly. I don't live with my parents, so we live in a house together that they, that they pay for. Dance hot, mosh not. No outside beverages, who's Jacob's fatter. I'm, it's like, imagine Nirvana, but like if Nirvana was like better live here. Walking distance, which is great, you know, in case I'm working late at the club, I don't have to worry about, you know, parking or whatever, also I don't have a car. Have I ever been in a band? That's a very good question. I'll answer that question in the form of a question, have or have I ever not been in a band? I'll answer that question with an answer, no, I've not been in, a, been in a band. No, I stopped booking emo bands because I found myself crying all the time and you know, you can't be bawling your eyes out when some kid wants two large Mountain Dews. Right now, there is a band getting t together for the very first time. The bass player's mom has just pulled out of the driveway. He's dragging his amp into the basement, they're practicing. I want to be their concert promoter and take 20% of everything they earn for the rest of their goddamn lives. My name is Ryan Skullface and I have my dream job.